Hello guys, welcome to my channel ICO Review Center. Today I am going to introduce to you a new project which is called Adobe Solutions. Adobe Solutions is the first cryptocurrency exchange functioning in accordance with Sharia rules. So, what are they really trying to do? As we know that Islamic finance is alternatively called ethical finance and this is an absolute fair name. According to Islamic Sharia law, a Muslim should not give money for growth to earn internet, uh, invest in prohibited activities like gambling, production of uh, prohibited products like uh, producing alcohol, uh, engage in transactions with excessive uncertainty. Muslims adhere to these requirements and they fear that such unverified investment methods like crypto uh, currency. Muslim finance system is basically based on a partnership between a client and financial institution that promotes the honest, transparent and reliable business relationships based on the culture, ethic and principle of Islam. That is exactly what blockchain technology is about. This technology is also based on ensuring honesty and transparency. A very necessary function for the modern world but unfortunately the rapid development of the industry led to a paradox. The cryptocurrency market attracted a huge number of foresters instead of cleanliness and transparency, market participants got a deception and a shadow market. So to overcome these tensions that is around every Muslim's mind, Adobe Solutions is trying to create a new platform which will provide a Muslim in society in which who are interested in cryptocurrency investment that they can depend on this platform to invest in only halal projects and this platform will be used for launching new halal projects and this platform will also be the first Islamic cryptocurrency exchange or in short FICE. As you can see on their website, they have outlined their objectives and mission of the project which is uh, this will be trying to solve the problem of aligning crypto assets with the high moral and cultural values of Islam by creating a global cryptocurrency platform for both Muslims and the world at large. They have their pre-sale upcoming in about 36 days so if you want to get whitelisted or uh, get involved in this project you can sign up by clicking on whitelist sign on here let's go to their white paper let's see let's see what they have written in their introduction as I have already mentioned that they will be trying to develop the FICE first Islamic cryptocurrency exchange based on Islamic Sharia rules. Arab solutions will create services based on the high moral and cultural values of Islam and will provide access to all users of crypto economics. They have outlined the 12 percent the growth rate of the Islamic finance sector per year. While the world market of Islamic finance assets has exceeded 2 trillion USD and forecasted growth to 3.78 trillion USD by 2022. As we can see on their white paper that they have um, written that this project will be registered under the UAE jurisdictions. So this is the choice that has been made to give this platform an acceptance to the Muslim community. This project will accept further jurisdictions from the Swiss Confederation called Canton Jog. The main difference is that this project will be governed by Sharia Advisory Council which is based on this platform and they will be the decision makers in 
every mm, decisions let's go into more details in this white paper let's see what they have their chapters on about as you can see the future of the digital economy and Islamic finance is one of the main priority that adapt solutions will provide for Muslim community uh, they will co consume it and pass Islamic expert assessment on compliance with Sharia law they will organize the Sharia supervisory board under the first Islamic crypto exchange they will adhere to documents and procedure prepared on the substrate stratum of a serious analysis that regulates the company work with crypto assets in accordance with the rules of sharia their main activity is mash la their um, activities is commented and additionally a qual seconding the benefits of this platform will also promote innovations promote job creations open and in open and access to capital for wide range of entrepreneurs thereby reducing the funding gap you can see that they have a graph on islamic finance asset growth on since 2012 to 2022 adab will try to be the global industry of Islamic finance in terms of segments and regions, Arabs arrangement and in ventures for Muslims and Islamic blockchain startup as well as it is an open commercial center for any individuals who requires to manufacture a legitimate innovation business. They can fill their applications on this platform so the Sharia committee look at it and they will decide whether that program will be launched on this platform or not adapt solution is based on ethereum blockchain they have their let's see as you can see adapts islamic adapt tokens are based on the erc20 standard and are subject to automatic execution upon the occurrence of pre specified conditions Adobe token holders cannot influence the team of the first Islamic crypto exchange on decision making. They have no right to have the business related activities. Adobe tokens are not securities, shares or they are equivalent and do not give the, the right to ownership of FICA. Their soft cap of this ICO is 2.5 million USD. And their hard cap is 18.7 million USD. Each token is worth 0.1 USD or 10 cent. The payment method for purchasing their ICO tokens are Ethereum and BTC. Their main sale ends on September 29th. Whereas their pre sale begins on 5th of 9 September whereas their public sale starts in September the 6th as you can see the launch of a smart contract will be happening on the late of November listing on exchange of their tokens will happen in December the minimum volume of redemption of ADAP tokens are 1000 ADAPs. As you can see on their white paper, they have outlined the distribution of ADAP tokens. 72% of total shares of token distributed among the community during pre sale and TGE or token generation event. 1% tokens allocated for marketing purposes poses and bounty campaign 15 percent token will be reserved for the creation and stabilizing the work of adapt solutions and the cost of the token 8 percent token will be belonging to the team and 4 percent token will be belonging to the advisory let's see what their roadmap is about 
as you can see that their stage one has already been completed which was the beginning of the study of the cryptocurrency market in the islamic community uh, which concluded on june 2017 their stage two has also been completed in later of last year the formation of goals and objective to address the problem of muslim access to the cryptocurrency market their stage three is uh, about to come in this year september to november holding an ico to finance and promote the islamic crypto exchange and exchange the first islamic crypto exchange and uh, during that period stage 4 will be registration of the fic and start of work on adopt crypto news portal and forum and adopt charity which will occur in October 2018. So there is just three and it's just four will be happening in the same time. Uh, we can see their ICO going on and in the back they will not be sitting behind and they will try to uh, take their project into a new destination by creating adapt charity news portal and forum. Now we can see their roadmap 6 which will be launch a large scale marketing campaign in order to attract new users on a large scale. Uh, the terms will be in December 2018. On February 2019 they are believed to release their beta version of FIC with the support of cross-platform trading clients and on May 2019 the official launch of FICE and run adopt charity will be happening in August 2019. They are going to for format a reliable developed infrastructure based on the principle of Islamic finance based on the adopt solution platform and FICE. This will happen in December 2019 and to July 2020. So we can give a positive verdict to this project as they are with huge plan and projections about what they are going to do in the next two or three years. They have outlined their visions on white paper perfectly. They have a very a big white paper of 65 pages. Now see who are behind this project. As you can see the CEO is Taimur Turjahan, the managing director and expert on financial services who is involved in financial management of companies. Extensive experience in creating a business. There is Rustam Turjahan, director and founder of own companies. 10 years of experience in the creation and management of enterprises in the construction and agro-industrial complex. He is the co-founder of this huge project and Magzad Salpin, he is the deputy CEO of Islamic Finance. Alexander Mamsipkov is the director of marketing with more than 10 years of experience in marketing and business development now let's go back to adapt solution let's see whether we need kyc or ml documents to purchase their token or use their platform we can see that information on here on documents click on documents and can see the, what the white paper uh, user agreement adapt token sell terms M A M L policy and kyc procedures and private policy are listed on the documents tab let's see do we need to do kyc yes KYC and MAL and combating the financial of terrorism CAT is required to purchase their token. We have to provide our identification uh, document to purchase their tokens and uh, use their platform for our benefit. I know for some investors, KYC is kind of frustrating, but in this kind of project where the team is very transparent and they know what they are going to do, uh, this is the kind of a project where KYC documentation will not be any kind of problem that I think. But 
it's up to you and uh, before you make any kind of invest in any ICO related projects or in any business please make sure you do your thorough research and you do your proper study on those program so guys what do you think about this great project which is based on blockchain technology